Good morning and welcome. It's Jilly Cube. I'm here in Queensland on the Sunshine Coast in Australia. Lucky me, it's an absolutely glorious sunny day. I've got all of my dogs lying on the floor and I'm about to create some art. So what's better than that? I've just mixed up some, this is, it almost looks black but it's a, it's navy. I mix it with phalo blue, a blob of black and a blob of very dark green. Gives a really nice navy. I'm just going to see if it's the right consistency. Maybe a little bit thick for what I'm going to do. So I'll just add a little bit of water to that for my black base. Black navy. It does look black black instead of navy, doesn't it? I'm getting this everywhere you can create without any um, prior artistic bone in your body as lots of people say to me I haven't got an artistic bone in my body but I'm pretty sure you will be able to create acrylic pouring and then it sort of alive and something in you and you then find creativity more than you ever thought possible I believe and you just give it a go so that is my base I'm gonna stick with that probably could do with my paint thinned a little bit more maybe maybe just make sure I've got plenty now so that is cool red and this is my champagne gold which is 50% metallic silver 50% metallic gold with my pouring medium in it righty-o righty-o and then I want to put this this is called wicker it's not a it's it's a sort of orangey yellow but I haven't I've had this for ages and I've never really used it because it didn't sort of strike me but when it's actually on the canvas it comes out quite nice quite nice so I'm gonna go with some of that too That looks very fiery actually, <laughs> it doesn't, um, yeah, it, it's very fiery looking, isn't it, like explosive, so let's see what we get out of that. If it doesn't turn out nice, it's not too much of a biggie, haven't used too much paint, so I'll just um, I'll see what I do, see what happens with it. So I'm just going to give it a whiz over with my heat gun this bursts any air bubbles now I'm, I'm kind of really thinking that I might try to change this your way blow up that way first it does look fiery doesn't it looks de definitely it might end up looking flamey so that'll be okay so I think I will do it that way <clears throat> let's try this thing I'll start in the, about the center of it <clears throat>
Wow. That's so nice. Oh my goodness. Well, I've never done that particular composition and colours before. The goal, I have to bring you down. I have to bring you down because that is, yeah, it does look like flames and Wow, look at this, look at those. That's that um, champagne gold, the yellow and orange. It's just created some lovely effects. And the colours definitely looks like a live flame. That would be a perfect colour combination to do a whole fiery effect. That's the whole thing. It's looking very, very nice. Well, I've surprised myself there because, um, yeah, I've not done that composition and colours before, so they've turned out pretty you beaut. I love them. What do you think? You let me know what you think. That's an interesting one. I think that I could have got away with actually putting more colour, like more of the same colours in so it showed up even better but um that is definitely a fiery chinesey dragony looking thing let me know what you think and uh yeah i will be back tomorrow so you guys please take care and join me again tomorrow my i'm here every day if you haven't subscribed press the subscription button uh it costs you nothing but it does help me so until tomorrow my lovelies I will say bye for now.